Italy's Campi Flagre volcano may have erupted more powerfully than thought. A new study reveals that the Campi Flagre volcano experienced a powerful eruption that deposited a large layer of ash and volcanic rock about 109,000 years ago. This eruption, dubbed Madaloni X6, was similar in scale to Campi Flagre's largest eruption, which occurred 40,000 years ago. It was so powerful that it created a caldera 15 kilometers in diameter. Although uncertainties remain, the Madaloni X6 eruption is likely the second largest explosive event to have occurred at Campi Flagre in the last 109. 00 years, wrote Giada Fernandez, lead author of the study and a doctoral student in Earth Sciences at Sapienza University of Rome. Campi Flagre is located east of Naples at the southern end of the fertile Campanian Plain. The soil in this region is rich in volcanic ash from a major eruption 40,000 years ago, making it extremely fertile. Confirmation of a major eruption older than previously known has new implications for the risks to the approximately 400,000 residents living within the caldera. The volcano has experienced seismic activity and changes in the land surface over the past 75 years, which could be signs of an eruption. However, according to Christopher Kilburn, a volcanologist at University College London, if Campi Flagre erupts, it will likely be small. However, if such large eruptions have occurred several times in the past, this suggests the volcano has the potential to produce large eruptions in the future. This finding changes our perception of the risk of Campi Flagre reactivating, Kilburn said. However, the study cannot confirm whether the Madaloni X6 eruption originated directly from Campi Flagrai or from a volcanic fissure north of the caldera. While the impact will remain the same for people living in the eruption zone, it's crucial for scientists to understand the early signs of future major eruptions. Researchers already knew about the existence of older layers of volcanic ash before the eruption 40,000 years ago. However, many traces of the previous eruptions have been erased by the most recent major eruption.
rocks from the Madaloni X6 eruption can now only be found in a few small cliffs in the Apennine Mountains or through deep boreholes. Fernandez and his team used data from these deposits to create a model of the Madaloni X6 eruption. They found that the eruption occurred in the Campi Flagre region and began with a massive explosion of ash and volcanic rock that formed a characteristic eruption cloud. This was followed by massive pyroclastic flows, flows of hot gas and rock that formed an overburden of rock up to two meters thick in some places. This eruption released 150 cubic kilometers of magma from beneath the Earth's surface. This amount is not much smaller than the largest eruption that occurred 40,000 years ago. By comparison, Canthi Flegre's last eruption in 1538 only ejected about 0.02 cubic kilometers of magma, according to Kilburn. Kilburn coined this study, an extraordinary example of research. He emphasized the need to better understand the magma pathways beneath Campi Flagre. If the eruption 109,000 years ago did originate from Campi Flagre, this would mean the caldera is capable of producing repeated large eruptions. If it originated from a nearby volcanic fissure, then that area also needs further study.